everyone, it's Erin. Um, today I'm going to be doing the TMI tag just because I thought um, what better way to get to know me is to learn too much about me. So if you want to know too much information, just keep watching. I've got my phone here so I'm going to be reading the questions. Um, what are you wearing? So I'm wearing this black scarf. I don't remember where I got this from but I've had it for a long time. Um, my cardigan is just from Katie's. It's just like a waterfall cardigan, like a flowy cardigan. And my um, red and polka dot top is from Blockout years ago. Um, ever been in love? Yes. I'm in love with my husband. Um, ever had a terrible breakup? Yes. But it was years ago and um, it was crap at the time, but I'm over it now, obviously. Um, how tall are you? I'm 5'5 five five or 165 centimeters, I think. I'm pretty sure. Um, how much do you weigh? I weigh 58 kilos. Any tattoos? Yes, I've got um, a little star on my wrist um, and all you need is love on my foot in my own handwriting. Um, any piercings? I've just got my earlobes pierced. I did used to have like three in one ear, two in the other, my tragus, my septum, two nostril piercings and a belly button ring. Um, but I've since taken them all out and let them all grow over. Um, OTP is Jack and Rose from Titanic. Um, favorite show at the moment I'm loving Game of Thrones because it's just started back. Um, I also love House of Cards and Walking Dead and um, Sex in the City. Um, favorite band is The Beatles. Um, something you miss would be like high school days when you have no responsibility and um, life's easy and carefree and you just have to worry about homework and chores and yeah, it was the easy life. Favourite song um, is Moon River which is in Audrey Hepburn's Breakfast at Tiffany's. I love that movie and I love that song. How old are you? I'm 27 and my zodiac sign is Virgo. What do you look for in a partner? Um, I like that my husband's really genuine, so he tells it how it is. And um, I'm a little bit of a dreamer kind of a person, and he's probably a bit more logical, so um, he's the yin to my yang. So I'm um, quite talkative and hyperactive and positive and all those things, and he's a lot more relaxed and quiet and... Um, I sort of hype him up and he relaxes me, so we're a good combination, I think. Um, favourite quote is that Mark Twain um, quote, sing like no one is listening, love like you've never been hurt, and dance like nobody's watching. And I just think it's really nice and um, positive. So, yeah. Favourite actor, um, I've got a little bit of a crush on Justin Long, um, because he's a bit nerdy and... I don't know, he's just cute. Um, I also love Ryan Gosling and quite a few different actors and actresses. Um, favourite colour is pink. Um, loud music or soft? I like loud music most of the time. Um, like in the car and everything, I like loud music. But I like soft music if I'm reading or if I'm writing something. Like when I was studying, I just used to have really, really quiet music on, if any. Um, whereas if I don't have to concentrate on reading or writing, I always have loud music. Um, where do you go when you're sad? Is just on the couch, under the covers, with a movie on or a TV show and a hot chocolate and just escape from the world on my couch. How long does it take you to shower? It takes me about 10 or 15 minutes usually. Um, longer if I have to like exfoliate and shave my underarms and... Um, do a hair mask or whatever, but usually about 10 to 15 minutes. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? It takes me about an hour, um, and that's to shower and wash my hair, um, do my makeup, get dressed, brush my teeth and make a coffee. Um, longer if I have to like do my hair fancy or you know, if I have to be really presentable for something, then I might take like an hour and a half to two hours. But usually, like day to day, about an hour. Um, ever been in a physical fight? No. My brother and I used to have play fights when we were little, but um, 
nothing serious ever thank god turn on this is a bit controversial because um, from the TMI tags I've watched, everyone says beautiful, nice things like, oh, I like a guy. Um, when a guy is like really sweet, that's such a turn on for me. Whereas I'm the exact opposite. Um, when I was single, I always used to get crushes on guys that were a bit mean to me or like used to give me crap about something or used to tease me about something. I don't know. It's weird, but that's just me. Turn off is bad breath or when guys are really full on when you first meet them um, and like really intense. Yeah, no. The reason I joined YouTube was um, to entertain, um, to share if I've got any knowledge about like beauty therapy that people are interested in, um, to bring a bit of light into the world and brightness into people's days and um, to share a bit of positivity with the world. I hope. Fears. So, I'm scared of the dark. I know, I'm way too old to be scared of the dark, but I am. Um, I fear failure and um, I fear something horrible happening to my loved ones because obviously you only want the best for your loved ones and you don't want anything bad to happen to them. So those are my fears. Last thing that made you cry was stress last week. It's all good now though. Um, last time you said you loved someone was about 15 minutes ago. Um, meaning behind your YouTube name. Um, Erin Brows is because I'm obsessed with eyebrows and my name's Erin. And I was working with a friend of mine months and months ago. Actually last year. And I was like, oh, I just want to do eyebrows all day. And like... I just want to book appointment after appointment of, you know, reshaping people's terrible eyebrows and blah, blah, blah. And he's like, you should, you could, you should totally do that. Like, I'll come and see you, blah, blah, blah. And, um, well, I don't know where we came up with the name Erin Brows. Anyway, and then the next time I was working with him, I was like, so, um, I've made an Erin Brows Instagram and an Erin Brows Facebook and I'm going to start doing YouTube videos and all this stuff. And he's like, well, that happened quickly. So, yeah. Um, last book you read... I can't remember. I know I didn't finish it. I think it was a book on, like, meditation. But I procrastinated and never picked it up again. Um, the book you're currently reading... I'm reading Ita Buttros, um, A Guide to Australian Etiquette. And I'm loving it. It's... Um, Got a lot of interesting information about like eating at international restaurants and like what's polite and impolite. Um, a lot about like modern technology and all that stuff. It was written in 2011 so it's like an updated version of her original book. And um, I'm really liking it. Like I think people think of etiquette as like walking around with books on your head and um, you know which fork to use for what. And it is a little bit like that but I don't think good manners ever really go out of fashion so... Um, and it was hard for me because when I first started reading the book, if there was things that I did, like I would read it and sort of feel a bit, oh, well, you know, I do that because blah, blah, blah. But I've sort of changed my attitude and I'm reading it as in, I'm reading this to learn. So just learn something from it. And now I'm really, really loving it. Such a good book. Um, the last show you watched was Game of Thrones last night. Loved it. Such a good episode. Last person you talked to um, was my husband. The relationship between you and the last person you texted again was my husband. Um, Favourite food is carbs. Pasta, pizza, potato, bread. I love it all. I'm such a carboholic. The place you want to visit. I'd like to go to Bora Bora. Or I've always wanted to go to Nepal or Vietnam. I think one of those places might be next, I think. Um, the last place you were was Fiji about two years ago. And I loved it. It's so beautiful there. It was my second time there. Um, and it was amazing. Do you have a crush? Only on my husband and Justin Long. Um, last time you kissed someone was about 15 minutes ago. The last time you were insulted was... About two or three weeks ago, and um, 
yeah favorite flavor of sweet is orange I love like orange starburst orange lollies I'm just a orange snakes I love orange I don't know what it is I just love them um, I don't play any instruments sorry I was always horrible at them so I just never continued um, favorite piece of jewelry is my um, wedding and engagement ring from my husband and um, this ring that I got from my family for a wedding present um, last sport you played again I was always horrible at sport um, really uncoordinated and um, never really pursued it but um, the last sport I played was netball probably like 12 years ago in high school um, the last song you sang was that new Justin Timberlake one was on the, the radio on the drive home not a bad thing something like that it's a pretty good song it's, it's catchy um, favorite chat up line um, none that I can think of I don't think chat up lines or like pick up lines really work I don't know they're a bit fake I think um, have you ever used it no I think um, the only thing I've ever said was like um, do you want to see a movie sometime and that's how me and my husband got together don't really, not really into the pickup lines um, last time you hung out with anyone was on Saturday night I went out with my friends Kat and Daz and my husband and we saw the Lego movie and it was really good um, if you've seen it comment down below I want to know if you liked it or not everything is awesome everything is cool when you're part of a team everything is awesome when you live in a dream um, who should answer these questions next anyone that wants to answer them I would love to see um, your videos so comment down below if you film this and um, thank you so much for watching and let me know if you have any suggestions for upcoming videos as well and um, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!